So yeah, we're pleased to announce the new um, Video Assist 12 gig HDR off-board recorders. So these devices um, introduce quite a lot of new technology to us in the Video Assist range. Uh, the 12 gig SDI, they are HDR based, so we have a 2500 nit display for brightness, but also we have Blackmagic RAW built in to these products as well. So what that means is we've taken the hardware encoder that we had in our own cameras, added it to the Video Assist family, and this is the really cool bit. We can now use that for recording to Blackmagic RAW from third-party cameras. So at the show, we're showing the Panasonic EVA-1, and also we support the Canon C300 Mark II, um, and recording from the RAW output of those cameras to Blackmagic RAW on the new Video Assist products. So for now, it's only uh, supporting SDI output, not HDMI output. Yeah, currently SDI, currently only those two products, those two cameras, um, but it's an ongoing work that will continue with the camera manufacturers. We look to sort of see how we can profile those cameras, then support them in the Blackmagic RAW codec, so you get the highest quality possible in what we think is the best codec for RAW performance. Technically, is it possible also to stream, let's call it, to stream out the signal uh, via HDMI and still get uh, uh, Blackmagic RAW? to be looked at. That would be down to the work that we do ongoing with the camera manufacturers. So there's a large number of cameras out there that have HDMI output for it, but we'll have some further advice as we go through and develop the, the support. Personally, what I'm happy to see that uh, manufacturers like Canon and Panasonic uh, actually talking to you directly and uh, obviously showing open mind in order to support the Blackmagic Raw product, it's, that's really nice. Uh, but one more thing for me, uh, because you are quite fast talking about the monitor that needs the brightness of yeah. it, and this is a big difference between the uh, current generation and the older one. Just a little bit about this. Absolutely, yes. so the older video assists really weren't designed for HDR, so they're 800 nit, they were designed really for us an off-board recorder or field monitor. These devices are designed from the ground up to support those HDR requirements, so it's a 2500 nit output on the brightness of both of these, whether it's the 5 inch or the 7 inch display. Uh, it will support full DCI-P3 color space and color gamut through those displays as well. And with it being a 12 gig SDI device, we'll also support 2160p60 and also 4K DCI formats into the recorders.